Today, NOAA issued its first outlook of the 2024 Atlantic hurricane season, painting a picture of how this year could play out. Meteorologist Brittany Van Voorhees breaks down the numbers for us. In 2023, the tropics caused $40 billion worth of damage across the United States. Now, record sea surface temperatures and a La Nina climate pattern could cause these numbers to be even higher in 2024. NOAA released their first prediction for this year's season, and as expected, an above average season is predicted. About an 85% officially, but these numbers, they're high. 17 to 25 named storms, 8 to 13 of those becoming hurricanes, and about a 4 to 7 of those becoming major hurricanes. Now, compared to Colorado State and NC State, they're pretty much on par, but substantially higher than the average numbers of 14, 7, and 3, respectively. Now, while we know in the Carolinas and across most of the Deep South, it only takes one storm to make a bad season, this forecast is notable for two main reasons. One, the agency is predicting the second highest ACE on record. This stands for accumulated cyclone energy, so it's based on the number and intensity of storms. Now, it's only behind the historic 2005 season which included Katrina, Rita, and Wilma. The second, it is the highest May outlook that NOAA has ever put out. Coming up at 545, we'll take a closer look at why.